Welcome back to part two of the tutorial in which we are actually going to start making the website. So to get started, you want to make a new project by going to sites, create new site, and I'm going to call it tutorial and select Immobilize for theme, click OK. And that should give you a blank page. To start adding things to the page, you can go to the add blocked page button. But before we actually do that, we should open up the Squarespace demo and take a look at what we are trying to achieve. So in this part of the tutorial, we are making the top section of the website. So we have the title here and the introduction text here. So when we go back into Mobarize, we need to find a block that has two text elements to it, one for the title and one for the introduction text. So let's open up Mobarize and see if we can find one that fits our needs. So click the add block to page button and you can have a look at these, see if you find something you like. I already did this and found one that works great for this, which is the article title with solid background. So click on that one and it's going to bring it onto the page. So if you compare this to the Squarespace demo, you can see that it looks pretty much nothing alike. And um, the reason why that is, is because the font is different, the font color is different, and the text is obviously different as well, along with the font size actually. So let's change those four things real quick. So open up the Squarespace demo and we'll start off by um, copying and pasting over the text. So there we go. And then to change the color of the introduction text, you simply click on it and click the color icon and change it to black. Now what we want to do is for the title, we want to change it to a title one. And to do that, you just click on the text and change it to a title one. Do the same thing for the introduction text, but change it to a title two. Okay, with that done, we need to change the font size and the font of the text. So to do that, you want to click the Edit Styles button that is for some reason not showing up here. If you run into this uh, problem, you can simply go to Sites and click the Edit Style, Edit Site Styles for your uh, project, and that should bring it back up. Okay, so for Title One, we want to change the font to be uh, Lato or Lotto. I don't know how to say that but uh, choose a font of your liking and do the same thing for a title too. Now let's change the font size to be about 1.2 for the title one and maybe like 3.2 for the title two. Okay, so with that done, uh, let's compare here. Um, so it's starting to look better, but it's quite, not quite right yet. So we need to create some space between the title one and title two. And to do that, there's, uh, there's a couple of ways you can do it. Probably the easiest one is just uh, click on the text and hit return a bunch of times and that's gonna create some space for you. Um, I'm not gonna do that because uh, I'd rather add a margin to it, but if you don't have access to the code editor, keep in mind you can just do it that way. So uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the edit code button and I'm going to look for the Sophia Ray text and see that it's an H2. So for the H2, I want to add a margin uh, margin bottom of maybe 140 pixels or something like that. And click Save, and that's going to create some space. So <clears throat> with that done, I want to reduce the padding uh, at the top a little bit so you can click on block parameters and reduce the top padding to maybe like one or one or two two maybe and we can add a little bit of padding to the bottom maybe set it to five and that looks pretty good keep in mind it's not going to be like a 100 percent replica of the squarespace demo but it's going to be pretty close so Let's compare again. Um, I think I added a bit too much space here, so I'm quickly gonna go back into the edit code and change it to maybe 120. Save and close. And 
that looks pretty good. So that's it for part two of the tutorial. In part three, we'll take a look at creating the full screen picture and services and pricing. So see you guys in part three.